show that uh, for us, it's really important to work like a bread. And uh, sometimes we are in a situation where we are stuck or we don't know exactly how to keep going. But the important thing is to develop ourselves. Or sometimes when you are trying to do your best in a situation, uh, it just it mean you are losing a lot of stuff and you don't have the enough concentration for them to do really well with your job. You need to still work. And uh, maybe you need the, the, this collaboration of a friend, like maybe helps you to, to see the different point of view of the, of the reality, like, um, but why you, are, you don't change completely to this project, or why you don't do that? And for me, it's a pleasure, and uh, it's like uh, I'm learning a lot from this type of experience. Yeah. I thought it was really this idea of this ritual coming in and doing this repetition, but it's different in a way, being directed to be different, but the similarities of the same thing and not getting out of the cycle whilst get it, using these directions to change the cycle, but it's the same cycle, the sort of idea of continuing to going on. I kept, I don't know, if it, kept hearing this, who cares? And this, this question of, you know, who care, who is the artwork for? Who is the performance for? Who, who cares about it? What's the reasoning? What's the thinking? And so, is it with this repetitive questioning? I thought it should be interesting. Uh, the thing that I would like to show in this performance is like it doesn't matter in what uh, media you are working. I mean, the filmmaking this year and discovering the performance is a uh, something that I don't work. I don't get used to, to, to work as much. Uh, the drawing, the sculpture, it doesn't matter. I mean, the artist, we have the manipulation or the, the important thing to me is our view of the reality and how we can interact, interact with uh, the situation that we are living. It doesn't matter the media or I can express the same in a still life or in a, uh, I don't know, uh, in a photography or, I mean, it doesn't matter what I, the important thing is the message and, and get involved with people. And sometimes uh, you need, for me this year it's really important to keep going, like, uh, Develop your ideas and uh, don't get stuck in a situation. Okay, this thing is not working. Uh, research about other type of stuff. Uh, do another type of things. Don't don't be afraid of go on and listen people. When people is like advising you, listen to them. You are always. Uh, you need to be always really prepared for that. And for me, it's really important. Like we we can't forget that we are human beings. We have our emotions. And uh, I mean, I'm pretty sure that every one of us is working when finished with the boyfriend, with the relationship is split. Everyone is working when we are depressed. It, I mean, an artist is a person, so I would like to show that all the time we are working and the sensation are not, I'm feeling good, I'm on the top of the world. No, because it's, it's, it's a lie. And also, I would like to show that with the makeup. The makeup, I think that for every one of us is a, some thing or some kind of protection. And if we don't put in the morning, maybe we don't feel good. So <coughs> it's like the same as like the painting. Try to be honest with but what you are doing. Can you um, perhaps tell us about um, some performances that might have influenced you? Sorry? Sorry? Could you tell us now about some performances that you've heard of? But perhaps not even seen that um, might, may, may have influenced you in, in your kind of way of performing. I well, I didn't. As I explained the first time, either I never worked in, in a performance before. But uh, a friend of mine in Italy is director of the scenography in Italy, and uh, sometimes I, I help uh, him to develop their ideas in a theater or something with another artist. So I try to work with him. Well, one of my dreams it would be to do a, it, it would be do a performance for him in a year, so I don't know. <coughs> but it, it's experience, I don't know, like I'm talking with Janine and Anastasia and people in the, in, in the travel of Cambridge, it's made me understand that maybe it's more interesting right now to get involved with people 
and show the character yeah, because people don't know the, the other side of the, the work of the artist. Maybe it's really frozen to arrive to an art exhibition and see the, the artist so glamorous or in this fake world, like you need to arrive like um, to seem really comfort, com confident with yourself. I mean, it's not important at all. The, the really truth is when you, day by day, are in your study and sometimes you feel really bad, sometimes you feel really trash, and you need to keep going. I mean, what can we do? I think that this is more interesting and more real than the other stuff. And we need to realize that sometimes the, the most part of the world that we are doing is trash. It's not good, I mean, but even though the trash is really good, because if you don't see the difference, you can see the, 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 the I mean, I don't like to, s to use the word masterpiece, but you need to be the difference between the, a really well done job and a trash job. And I think that it's about the research of yourself and, and get involved with people. I like to, for, uh, I, I can't imagine the thing that I'm doing this year without people, because I'm changing like that to like that. In a way, you said earlier on that um, you're talking when you're making these things, but you're talking about them being trash, and then you answered a question, I think it was Dizzy's, and you said, well, um, it's not important to you whether they are trash or not. So I think in, in terms of the performance, you should keep in this kind of circle that doesn't really answer any questions. So keep away from um, the idea that anything could be a masterpiece or because you're putting us into a situation where you want us to believe that each piece is, it's not important whether it is or it isn't. Well, for me, this is another me message. I think that it's not important because I think that um, I saw this morning the example for me, the, the words of Nancy, for me is really important for a stay at the, the, the gallery. I mean, I don't, I'm, I'm, ans I'm asking myself and maybe one year or two years she can be in the, the gallery, but if she don't arrive, I mean, for me, she's a great artist. What is the success? For me, it's a fake, I'm discovering also that it's a fake world. Maybe she don't have uh, behind her uh, an important critic or an important person. Maybe she don't arrive, never, as same as me, but for me, she's a still a great artist. That's the point that she is, working hard every morning. That's the point. I would like to show that even a job, it could be trash. Who can, who can, who can have the power for decide if one thing is really good or not? Hasper Jones is really famous, and for me, it's a trash of painter. She don't, in my opinion, he don't know how to mix that colors, but it he's on the top. Jasper Jones, right. for me, it's horrible. It's an American and uh, in a period that don't exist uh, any important American painter that anyone puts him there and anyone is questioning. That's the word like that. I mean, it's like the, the Chinese whisper, like all the people is talking, 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 but anyone has the courage for say, I think that it's not a good art artist. Because the society is telling that it's true. I mean, it's fashion, it's trendy, it's nice, and all the people is following. It's really personal. I mean, I can be really, you know, a mistake, but for me it's like that. And maybe, I don't know, maybe for you it's nice. For me, in my way of learning and uh, my academic background, for me, the thing that I did today is not good. But I don't know if appears one guy in the in the door and, oh, it's great, I would like to, to do an exhibition of you. And, uh, you know, for me it could be really upsetting me, but, I need to accept that reality. I need to stay inside of that world, but maybe not in the way, because I'm realizing that sometimes in life you want to stay inside in a, in a situation and you can't in the way that you first dream. It's like the situation mm -hmm. that arrived and reached the point. Our world is really weird to me sometimes. 